Today we're in San Luis Obispo County. We're at Shandon Elementary School, and today we're here to... Well, today we're at Shandon School, and I've got seventh grade student, Samantha. How are you? Oh, you're in sixth grade. <laughs> you know what? I was going to make you do a seventh grade problem, and you're in sixth grade. You're good with that, right? Oh, good. You'll be yeah. fine with it. All right, turn around. Let's get busy on this problem. All right. You're going to travel 6,760 miles. What's the number? 6,760 miles. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to make this larger so that we're going to be able to see it a little bit easier. So we're going to write this size. All right, you ready to go that size? Mm -hmm. All right, now, do you like to read? Occasionally no. some, a little bit? Well, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna read a book every 450 miles. All right, so every 450 miles you go, you're going to read a book. The question is, how many books will you read during that whole travel time? So every 450 miles, so if you wanna write it down, 450 miles, Oh, wait. <laughs> you got the erasers right there. That's okay. So 450 miles equals one book. All right. So if you're going to travel 6,760 miles, how do you think you're going to figure out how many books you're going to read? Division. Division. All right. So we're going to take this number and do what with it? Mm. Divided by something, right? Yeah. Divided by what? By that. Okay. So let's go ahead and divide it by 450. All right, so talk me through this. How are you going to solve this? Mm, I'm going to see how many times 450 goes into 676. Okay, and how many times do you think that'll happen? Once. No. Yeah, once. You, you think it could go twice? Because if we did two times this, what would it be? Let's go two times 400. Uh, 60? No, no. 400 times 2. 800? Right. And that's already too high. Right? So we know it's not going to go two times. So you were correct in saying that it's only going to go once. So where will the one go? Perfect. Yeah, you didn't have to borrow, right? You were thinking about it already, but you could just go six minus zero. <laughs> All right, so now what? So now how many times do you think 450 will go into 2,260? So think about rounding it first. Let's, let's think about 400. And let's make that 2,000. So to make it easier, think about 4 into 20. Five times. Five times, right? So why don't you try 5, and we'll see what happens. Then we'll know if we have to go up or down a little bit. So you can go 450 times 5 if you need to work it off on the side, and you can do that. So it does work, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, that's it. So what are you left with? Ten. Ten. Now, if you read a book every 450 miles and you only have ten miles left to go, are you going to be able to read another book? No. So how many books were you able to read? Fifteen. There you go, Samantha, nice and easy.